Ready? Yeah. Okay. Uh, first, I'm just curious, you've got guys like Austin out there and all that. Um, people talk about his leadership. I'm curious what kind of things you've seen or maybe even learned from him after only a couple of weeks. Uh, you know, Austin is, a, you know, as, as you said, he's a great leader, a uh, great competitor, you know, uh, a great veteran, you know, that, you know, he's a guy that young guys can easily, you know, lean on, you know, ask questions and, you know, just try to figure this thing out with. I feel like Austin, you know, has been a great addition to our, our team as far as a leader. What have you seen from Jaden after just a couple of weeks with him? Uh, he's coming along very well. You know, he's just, you know, you know, taking what's, you know, what's given to him right now. You know, he's just kind of, you know, learning. We don't expect him to just come out here and first day, first week, you know, just have it all under control. We just expect him, you know, just continue to take strides each and every day. And we just want to continue to see that enthusiasm to learn and just get better every day. What's Cliff been like as an OC so far? I love Cliff. You know, he uh, he has great energy. You know, uh, I feel like he, he does a great job with, you know, trying to get to know his players and his personnel and just know how to best, you know, utilize us and, you know, put us in the best, you know, position to make plays. And I feel like, you know, you know he's been doing a great job of that, you know, and I appreciate him for that. What shows you that he's trying to put you guys in the best position to make plays and get to know you? Uh, just based off of how we do things in the meeting room, you know, just how we meet and, you know, communicate, you know, from the meeting room to the walkthroughs to, you know, on the field, you know, just, you know, having that, you know, great communication and trying to build a, a bond within our, our offense to just make us all come together. You know how last year ended, right? You were part of this. Um, what kind of mindset did you come in with this season with a brand new staff? What's the vibe right now in your room? I mean, we get to set the tone for, you know, what we want for this year, you know, within the staff, within the locker room, within this whole organization. You know, we get to set the tone for, you know, how we want this year to go based off of just how we, you know, put the pass behind us and attack what's in front of us, you know, and as long as guys continue to, you know, be where their feet are and attack what's in front of us, and in front of them, we will continue to just make strides in the right direction. And what have you seen from this staff? You mean, when, they, when the new guys come in, you, you have to go, I wonder what we're getting. What are you getting? Uh, they've been great. You know, I feel like, you know, the staff been, you know, great working together. You know, they've been great working with us, you know, just trying to find the best, best ways to help us, you know, as a team. And I feel like as long as they continue to, you know, just, you know, put that foot first to just make sure their team, you know, is good, then we will continue to just build a great conne uh, connection and relationship. It's obviously early in the install, but what kind of differences are you seeing from Cliff's offense from what you guys have been running? I mean, it's, it's going to be a little bit faster, you know, as far as, you know, if I'm comparing it to offense we had last year, I don't really want to go much into detail as far as, like, what kind of play calls we will have. I just know the tempo will be faster, you know, uh, compared to last year. We had a, you know, you know huddle, a huddle type of offense. You know, this offense would be more no huddle. So uh, if I can give any idea of, you know, how this offense will go, it will be a no, no huddle offense. Are, are you excited about it? I'm excited. I, I love ball. You know, any offensive scheme you put me in from no huddle to huddle, I can adjust perfectly fine to do, you know, what I need to do and what my coach needs me to do for the offense. What uh, what'd you do this offseason in terms of getting ready for the year? Uh, just relax, take care of my body, you know, kind of, you know, same thing everybody else do. You know, most people, you know, hit the offseason hard and work out and train every day. Me, personally, you know, I, I take my mind away from the grind a little bit, take my mind away from ball and just kind of get in spaces that's where I feel most comfortable. Good to see you, B-Rob. Uh, obviously, um, coming into this year mentally, physically, uh, is this the best you felt, I mean, as a pro in the NFL coming into here? I mean, besides when I first got drafted and all the crazy stuff happened, uh, yes, this is the best I've felt, you know, since, you know, uh, probably right after I got drafted here. Why do you think that is? Uh, because, you know, it's a work in progress to get back to where I am now from where I came from in my first year. You know, you mentioned the vibes, high, you know, coaching staff. What type of adjustment has that been for you and the, the players to adjust to kind of this coaching staff and what they're selling and how are you guys embracing that? Uh, I think it's been great for not even just me, for just, you know, everybody to kind of adjust to this coaching staff because they've been, you know, so, they've been so good just with how, how they connect with us, you know, and the conversations we have and the type of conversation we have in the meetings and just, you know, just building that connection that we probably just didn't do, you know, beforehand. You know, we just ain't have the coaches or maybe the coaching staff that we felt like we can build a comfortable relationship with so we could take that relationship, 
you know, from the me room to the practice field to the game field. So I feel like we, we got a jump start with that right now. Thanks to Coach Quinn, just allowing us to just, you know, just be more of a team. And um, I think that's, you know, really helping us, you know, get, get off to a, a good head start right now. Hey, hey Brian, with, with your position coach, Anthony Lynn, what are you learning on the early part of working with him? And how have you seen your game change with him at your position coach? I mean, uh, I know he's, he has a lot of knowledge, experience. He, he's played at this level. And uh, he has a lot of tips and things he, he, he can leave with us that are just, you know, help us take out to the, you know, to the practice field. You know, and uh, we getting better every day. You know, it's just we're just getting started. You know, for a long season to come. You know, and I'm sure I will continue to see my game translate. You know, over time. You know, right now we just kind of putting down the base. You know, fundamentals to just how we want to uh, go to work.